because yeah, I still can't check in. Just scuba dived in the barrier reef. Great barrier reef, what the hell? We're going on a road trip tomorrow for three yeah. hours. Oh. It's 4 a.m. I've just got, a, I've just walked to a train stop. Got a train for 10 minutes an hour. I'm on the way to the airport. I'm going to the, dis oh, I'm going to the domestic airport so that I can get a flight to Cairns. It is early, but. It was easy getting to the airport. I thought I was going to have to pay for a taxi, but there was so much transport, it was so easy. This was the hostel. Obviously, it was really quiet, so I could only get a few clips. And then the kitchen was shut, so I couldn't even go in, but I'll show you what I got. Um, I have left Jamie, by the way. I'm doing the work away on my own and then meeting up with Jamie again once. Which way do I go? I think it's up there. Um, I meet Jamie again on the 5th of July once I finish my work away. It's probably the 19th, 20th of June. Oh, it's my cousin's birthday! Oh, I'm through! Okay, I'm just going to um, get a cup of tea. I'm not going to get anything to eat, but I'm going to get a cup of tea and then I'm going to go to a gate. But we don't board till 20 to 6. It's 10 past, so we've got like half an hour. Oh my god, I'm in Cairns. I actually can't believe it. It's like 26 degrees. It's gorgeous. I took some stunning pictures. And now I'm just waiting for my bag because obviously I checked one in. And then I'm going to get a bus or I'll figure out how I can get to my hostel. I queued up in that taxi line for ages. But I then found that there's some shuttles, which are $20. And I had no idea how much the taxis would be. So I'm getting this shuttle, uh, I think, from here. Uh, Charlotte, mine. Yeah, is that mine? Thank you. <laughs> yeah, it's my first time, so I have no idea. I think it, yeah, in like two weeks she'll come up and then we'll have the van together for six weeks. Yeah. I'm coming up from, doing, from Sydney to Cairns in a few weeks. Actually. Really? In a car? Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, that's amazing. Thank you so, so much. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. We're only going to put one on. Enjoy. Thank you so much. Enjoy your trip from Sydney. Thanks. Bye. I've just met a really nice guy called Spencer, who is a receptionist. Um, I'm in another luggage storage room. If you see my Sydney vlog, this is what I did. I had to drop off my stuff early and then I can check in at like two. This is my storage room and I'm going to go have a wander around the hostel actually. So. So I just got changed and this is the hostel. I think these are the rooms, obviously I still can't check in. I just needed to get changed into some of us. So I'm gonna go and find somewhere where I can grab a bite to eat. It's so warm, oh my god. Oh my god, I want to swim it. Oh my god. I'm gonna worry about my phone later, uh, not my phone, my video later. I really just wanna sit with my feet in. Oh my god, these are like barbecues. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is amazing. This is gorgeous. I can't even, I, can't, I got no words. Yeah, so um, Spencer said before, he said that um, if we were looking for a beach and this isn't the right place, which I get what he means, but what the hell, this, bit, this swimming pool is gorgeous. And it's only like 10 o'clock in the morning. It's 25 degrees. I just hid my laptop, not very well, but whilst I was ordering food at the bar, this is the view. Also, these cost me $21 something, and I think it was like £11. It is roasting. I feel like, like, because Sydney wasn't cold, but it wasn't hot. It wasn't even warm, really. It was cold in some parts, but like, because it's their winter, I didn't really know what I was expecting. But it is so nice. It's so nice. I wish I had my bikini now. Everyone's in bikinis and sunbathing and I found sunbathing this and just wearing a crop top and some shorts. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's actually gorgeous. Just checking in. These guys are in front. Then I'll go and get my stuff and move in. So I think. 
Got my key, got a free drink token, and I'm on 12, so I just need to follow it around. But... Yeah, <laughs> this is the upstairs bit. Isaac, say hi. Hello. <laughs> oh, it's really nice though. So it's like eight ish now. Oh no, maybe like seven. Um, and I've been out for a few drinks in the hostel with some people that I made friends with, which was really nice because I was really nervous. Because obviously this is the first one that I'd been in. Obviously last night I was in a hostel with people, but I was literally in and out because of the flight. Everyone has been so, so nice. And I've just been sat having a few drinks with people. So I'm on this top bunk here and there's lockers there and then beds here. So I'm in a bed of two, four, six. Eight, eight, yeah. So this is Ricky. She's just come into Hi. this house, this house, <laughs> this um, hostel, and literally five minutes in, they were telling me what they're doing tomorrow. And so I booked on. They're going to, like on a, a snorkel. What even is it? A snorkel yes, trip. Snorkel cruise tour. Yeah. Or so I booked on really quickly. Diving snorkel. Yeah. That you you are snor uh, scuba diving, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. I haven't booked that part yet, but I can decide tomorrow if I want to do it. So excited! So excited! <laughs> I booked it in literally like three minutes. It's so cool. I, I was like, "Oh, guys, what are you doing tomorrow?" Because Anna's in in the shower, and you told me then, and then I was like, "Well, I'll do that." And booked on. <laughs> Good morning. I'm going on a snorkeling trip today. How excited! It's seven o'clock. Um, but yeah, how exciting! It's cost me a hundred pound um, for eight hour trip, snorkeling, blah blah, everything. So I'm very excited. I'm very excited. Yeah, it's that boat at the end. I wasn't going to do the um, uh, scuba diving. I was only going to do the snorkeling, but I've just been easily persuaded again after like five minutes. That happened yeah. last night. Um, and I'm doing the scuba dive. <laughs> there was only one spot left after these two, and these two both did it, and then I'm doing it now as well. <laughs> We're getting ready. Oh. oh my god, that was incredible. They were the brightest bit. We just swam in the barrier reef. I just scuba dived in the barrier reef. Great barrier reef, what the hell? That was insane. But I couldn't take any pictures because it was their first intro dive, so you couldn't have any. You, but I have a uh, waterproof phone case, couldn't take it down. If I do it again, which I have to pay 54, I could do it. How was it, guys? I saw a shark as well. Yeah, we were in two different groups, but me and my group fans saw a shark. It was so good. I know. My <laughs> It was worth it. They were probably about. But we got no photos from. Oh, I, I know, that's what I was just thinking. But if we snorkel, we'll be able to. It just won't be as deep because obviously it'd be a different angle because we were right now. There were so many people. Yeah, of course. Like some of the fish were like bright, bright blue. And like the coral, and we saw a clownfish and I saw a dory. <laughs> it was, that was amazing. That was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
I'm so happy. I hope I got some good videos here. It's unreal. Actually unreal. Now and I think we're gonna go to the lagoon for a bit, just for a bit of chill time. And then we have no idea. Yeah, so I have got a refund for my trip uh, bus tomorrow. So we're going on a road trip tomorrow for three Yay! hours up to um, up to the Daintree for the hostel that I'm checking into. And these guys are gonna go on a little adventure. Um, but for now, we're gonna drive somewhere else. Um, these two are on the second parking ticket. <laughs> <laughs> when did you get your other one? Okay, of the week, yeah. second of the week. dollars for nothing. Oh. Yeah. We're gonna go to the lagoon now. We're just moving the car because so they don't get another parking ticket. Yeah. <laughs> you could have stayed there for the day, no? You're yeah, that's true. We've already gone here. <laughs> that guy over there is just barbecuing. I showed you them yesterday when I walked past, but that is such a cool way to live. I love it. <laughs> I'm having pancakes for breakfast this morning. <laughs> This one works there. And there's like toppings and stuff. And then we're going on our road trip. But yeah, that hostel that we're in is called Bounce. So good. They have free breakfast. So we just got pancakes. It's free breakfast every day. Pancakes every day. It's actually raining. <laughs> it's actually quite nice because it's still hot. We're off again. This is their car. Hey. <laughs> That's space for you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so we're in Palm Cove. It's the spa capital of Australia, apparently. It's camper vans, the beach, and one <laughs> If you wanna, if you gotta stay. Hopefully. <laughs> Which one looks good? Shall I put some money in here? Oh. <laughs> How look your coconut? Like bright or dark? Say that again. What colour had your coconut when you drank it? What? I don't know. Why is there a difference between light and dark? But they're light. They're really light. Yeah. Maybe it's... it's <gasps> There's a milk in it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. That's so cool. There's no milk. Then we should take this one. Oh, it's got a new home. We need a knife. Yeah, a big knife. What's his name? <laughs> <laughs> um, we've named our camper van Colin the Camper. That's my Colin camper van name. Um, what's coconut? Coco. Coconut. Um, Coco. 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 That's so basic. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Coco is waiting to get eaten. <laughs> <laughs> so we've just been talking to these guys here. They think we're a bit early for um, to see crocodiles. Um, it's like 10 a.m. something, so I think maybe like 4 or 5 p.m. we'd see more. Apparently they saw a massive one over here, behind this bridge, obviously, like on, right over here. We've just come to another lookout spot. I don't know how much I've filmed. Uh, we're looking for a lighthouse. We thought this was it, but it's not. It's just a gorgeous lookout spot. Then we're going to go to a beach. We've just walked. We've been on a walk, pits up the car and then driven again. Um, and we're going to go for lunch somewhere. Well, we know where we're going to a thing. Yeah, um, like a beach spot. I bought some food. Food? 
food yesterday from the shop and we're just gonna have a little picnic. These guys are gonna make a salad, they're just over there parking. And I think I'm gonna get to the Daintree Hostel around like five-ish tonight. I'm gonna lay this out, my trusty blanket. I've just climbed down there, it's not very really high, but I've just climbed down there to come for a paddle because it's scorchy. The girls are just up there. That guy's fishing. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> There's no other way you can get here. Forty-five dollars return, but there's no public trans tra transport. I mean, you can still share from all the people in the car. Yeah, but still, if there's only one of you, there's no public transport at all. So yeah. I cancelled the bus yeah. and came with these guys instead for a road trip. Woo! <laughs> I was thinking that for you, but there's no camping up there. Oh. But if people don't come check, then you could. Hey, that's the cat. That's the van we're in. Oh my God, yeah. oh. But without the top bit. <laughs> oh my God. So beautiful. Wow. 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 Thanks so much. Oh, God, you're blurry. Wait, all your horses. There you go. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Thank you. Maybe see you later or tomorrow. <laughs> this is my home for the next few weeks. Oh, my God. This is so, so exciting. So exciting. They're just driving to their campsite. And I'm going to check in. Oh, my God. I just dropped my bags off. And then just go into the toilet. I don't even need it. I just thought I'd have a walk around. Oh my god, this is amazing. We've just finished off doing dinner for everyone and I've just got we've just got ours. So some pasta salad basically. This is the kitchen area. And I've just been sharing my bedroom and it's perfect. So this is my bed for the next two weeks. I've had the best evening I as soon as I got here I don't know what I filmed but as soon as I got here basically they were all no there was one of the worker here at the time she was um prepping food in the kitchen so I went and joined um just to help out and then it got very busy for about an hour so I just did all the dishes and stuff and we were chatting and it was so nice then I came to my room was in my eye came to my room which is this one um, the power's off at the moment. The power's only on certain times in the day. So I'll show you tomorrow. Came, sorted my room out, but basically just brought my bag and made my bed with the linen. And then went and had dinner, um, which is some like, pasta salad thing. It's gorgeous. And then played Monopoly. Deal. Monopoly deal. Not, just, not normal Monopoly, but I'd never played before. And there was like six of us doing it. It was really fun. So it's half nine. I did leave everyone there for still playing another round, but I'm really tired. Um, so I've come to bed to get sorted and I can go to sleep. And then tomorrow I'm working, doing the housekeeping, 10 till one, I think. And then I'll be exploring Daintree Rainforest. If you don't know what work away is, I'll tell you about it in the morning. <laughs> okay, I'm going to bed now. Good night guys. Um, I might actually end this vlog here because I'll start a new one for the Dane Tree. So thank you so much for watching. I love Cairns and I can't wait to go back. Bye!